Imagine you are in the army during World War Two. You get a new officer, and he is a traitor. Five hundred people in your camp have to go to Omaha Beach under his command. You have to save everyone. Happy Remembrance Day or Veterans Day, as well, depending on the country you are in. I have traveled all the way back to the World War II era, and it seems I have a message here from a person who calls me friend. I'm sorry I didn't tell you about this before, but I ran away. I think that the new officer cannot be trusted. He's training us to lose. He will probably kill us soon, so I went on the mission to Omaha Beach from Joan. And we have a new objective all of a sudden. To go to the officer's office. Amazing, the officer actually has his own office. Amazing, amazing, amazing. And the rules, apparently we have some rules here. Don't break block unless told so. And do not place, oh, do not go any place you're not supposed to be. And no mods or creative. Um, I think I am good there. I'm on survival mode. And... Okay, so let's go find the officer's office, shall we? Um... So we have Captain Dempsey's office, and nothing, oh, what's this? David's journal. I was walking close by Sam's camp when I heard a gunshot from his cabin. I saw Officer Max with a gun and Sam dead on the floor. Oh, uh, God, please help me. Okay, that just sounds utterly eerie. Very eerie. Reminds me too much of when I saw Carrie in theaters with my mother. Wait, wasn't there a chest in here? I think there was. Yes, that's where all my stuff is. Hooray! I have stuff. And I don't need any of those creatures looking at me while I change. That's just creepy. Wouldn't you mobs agree? That's just creepy. Just absolutely crazy. There, I think I like that setup. Now, let's see this one. Officer Max, oh my gosh. Holy, holy crud. I think we're already here. Let's see this place out. He seems to have a message for us. And his journal says, We have over 500 people going to Omaha Beach. At least 450 of them will die. Hitler will be very proud of me. And the new objective is to go to the other camps and read their journals. Well, I've read another person's journal, so I think I'm good there. And, uh, can barely see anything in these cabins. Let's see, this guy is Private John Johnson. And we have a zombie already. Perhaps a Nazi zombie? Since we already have some involvement with Hitler over there. And this is World War II. Sounds legitimate to me. Oh, and this guy's got a journal. And a book. But it's obviously empty. And his journal says... I accidentally shot a bullet, and it almost hit Sergeant Ryan. I thought I was going to have to be punished badly, but Officer Max didn't do anything. 
I have a bad feeling about him. Okay, so apparently Officer Max isn't probably the greatest person. Like the greatest leader of all or anything. Uh, but what can we get from Private Nolan's cabin here? Let's see. He's got an empty chest, but he's got a journal, which I can barely see because it's so dark. Let's see here. Today, I was told that I was going to Omaha Beach. Officer Max said that it would be safe there to start a base. Well, judging from the other thing saying that he's a bad person, that must not be a good thing. Apparently. I may be wrong, though. So, who's last? Private Jacob or Sergeant Tierney? Let's go, Jacob. Why did I just hear a bat? There's bats in World War II? Okay. And this guy's got his stuff way up. When I was shooting targets, I was just about to fire a bullet, but Officer Max stopped me and made me two, three hundred push-ups. Wow, oh, that's a lot of exercise. Even more than I can do, for goodness sake. I think there's something about the target that he doesn't want me to know about. And our new objective is to go to the firing range when no one else is looking. Well, so far, I think there's only mobs that could look, so I will hopefully be safe there. And here's the last cabin to check out. Full of redstone and signs. Sam's journal says, Officer Max is a traitor. A traitor? Wait. Traitor? Trader? Okay. Maybe he traded stuff. Maybe he was a scammer. I think that must be what it was. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. I was in his office when I saw a note that said I am a stash. A stash. Is he cursing? And that was not a good idea. Or what? It sounds like he might be cursing. Because it sounds like a bad word to me. Oh gosh, there's creepers too. Oh, there. Take that, Hitler. You're not gonna get me today. Nuh uh. Alright. Uh, there's even more bad mobs this way. I'm not sure I trust going that way, to be quite honest. Um, hello, um, don't mind me, I'm just going to kick your butt. Oh gosh. Wow. No wonder why this place looks like rubbish. Even have creepers blowing up on us all. Goodness. Oh wait. Oh crap, I wasn't supposed to destroy but Wait I'll just blame it on the creeper, 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 baby. And what did that just do? Oh gosh. I think that was a bomber something. What was that? I didn't do Maybe I'll just get one shot. Okay, that does n nothing. And I couldn't even absorb... Oh, I did absorb the arrow back. Awesome. Suits me. <laughs> and it is... Um, and gorgeously... And gorgeously... I'm not sure that's a good word to pick here. Um, it's just very dark. Um, 
Maybe that's why I have this. And come on, baby. You know I want shot. Trust me, man, I have loads of gun practice here. Although, I guess in this world war. Oh, gosh. This. Oh. No, he didn't. Yes! In one shot, I killed the skeleton. It's a narrative here. <sighs> I never thought I could get so far without dying. Especially at night time. And... So this is what everything's been leading me to. I wondered. And I have a lot of mine cards. Okay, listen, everyone who is going to Omaha Beach is in a lot of trouble. Many of the people will die. So I need you to go because everyone who is going will explode if you don't destroy the bomb and kill Officer Max. You will have to get there before everyone else does. From... God? And I, I never thought I'd get this honor. Thank you, God. I, I, I... I am absolutely honored to get the opportunity of um, doing this. Holy crap! Oh. Whoa, whoa. Holy crap. Never been on a coaster like whoa. this before. I think that means that's the end of Dead End Gulch. Or so it is apparently. Ooh, ooh, curvy. I never knew they were so curvy in World War II. Although they're definitely, um, uh, me call it. Aww. That's all the ro oh. Guess that is all of the ride. Interesting. I wonder what's to come next. <laughs>